Jack, you've just signed your first professional contract. How are you feeling? I'm over the moon, to be fair. It's something you always dream of as a kid. And I think I've worked hard over these past few years, so I'm very happy and I'm just excited to kick on now. It's been quite a quick rise through the academy. You obviously, you joined at under 15s level, yeah, yeah. under 16s level, sorry, after stints with Man City, Blackburn, and Stockport Schoolboys. Yeah. How's that journey been for you? Because obviously, it's been quite a rapid rise from under 15s, under 16s to making your debut later yeah, on down yeah. the line. Yeah, when I first came in, obviously, uh, the setup was a bit different. But um, I think ever since I've come in the building full time, like you said, my my growth and my exposure to the first team has been rising, and I've been given some like, really good experiences like Derby away, obviously Shrewsbury when I was young, but I think that shaped me to become the player I am now, so I'm thankful for that they put the trust in me, but it's now how I kick on again. And you made your debut in the EFL Trophy against Shrewsbury, yeah, yeah. it feels like a lifetime ago now. Yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> uh, just how were you feeling in the build-up to that? Did you know? Uh, how did you feel when you got the call to, to come on in that game? Well, I only found out a few days before, and I was, obviously I was, I was 15 at the time, so I was a bit like, wow. I never met any of the, uh, the lads and that, so I was, obviously I was scared. And when they told me I was coming on, I was just like, wow. I felt like a, bit like a, rabbit, a rabbit in the headlights. But, no, nah, that, was, that was a good experience. That's what I'll keep with me forever. And from there, you went on to score your first league goal against Barnsley this yeah. past season. How did you feel? Was it something that you dreamt of, scoring in front of thousands of fans? Just talk us through that feeling. Well, I don't think a header is what I dreamt of. I've never scored a header in my life. But um, no, obviously, it's, it's when you're a kid, all you think about is scoring a professional goal. So that was a great experience for me. And obviously, I didn't expect it at all because I didn't think I'd come on, to be fair, in that game. But when I did, I just showed what I could do. And in your debut and scoring that first goal, you went on to become the youngest ever professional appearance for the club and goal yeah. scorer in the club's history. <coughs> yeah. How's that feel? <laughs> it's to be fair, it doesn't really, it's never really sunk in really. Obviously, it's a massive, massive thing for the club and for me and my family, but I just try and take it in my stride and try and use that confidence to show people why I am that, that player and how I scored so young. And obviously, been in and around the first team for a, a good while now. Yeah. Uh, How has it been? To work with the gaffer, how's he helped you come on this last few months since oh, he's been he, in the build? He's, he's been great to be fair. Obviously, like I said, the first game I played under him was Derby, which was such a good experience to play in front of that many that many fans. And towards the end of the season, he's given me a lot of trust and game time to showcase all what I can do. So hopefully, with the season coming on, I can do that and show the show the manager and the fans what player I can be. And when you got that call from the gaffer, from Will Ryder, to say that you are going to be offered a, a professional contract, just how did that feel? It was a bit of a relief, to be fair, because obviously when you're, when you're a scholar, all you're thinking about is your professional contract, and it was just a big relief. But obviously now it's time to, this is just a start, to kick on and try and get my next contract and keep working my way up. And speaking of kicking on, obviously we just finished one season, yeah. we're now in the build-up to the next season. Just how much are you looking forward to getting back in the building and getting oh, going again under the gaffer? Can't wait, to be fair. Can't wait to get back in for pre-season and try and become a, become a squad player, an important player for the team and show the fans and the manager what I can do. Jack, congratulations, mate. Cheers, thank you.